we've been doing things for so many years after independence, and that transformation wasn't coming. And so coming into government and heading the economic management team, um, the president gave me that mandate and gave me that opportunity to focus on how best we can transform and modernize Ghana to make sure that some of the challenges, some of the risks that, you know, people who just want to operate in our economy are facing. So how we mitigate those risks, how we make this economy an efficient economy. And this is why I have focused on digitalization. Sometimes people say, well, we thought you were an economist, but you are doing so much in IT space. Um, have you left economics behind? Uh, no, no, not at all. In fact, it's because of the economy that I'm focusing on the digitization. Because without building those pillars, our economy will just not be able to stand on its own feet. We need to build those pillars to allow all our sectors in the economy to be able to compete. And so we decided to address some of the major bottlenecks that businesses face, you in the agri sector face, through digitalization. First of all, whatever problems that exist and make this economy inefficient affects everybody. Whether you are in a Greek or industry or services, you will face those problems. If you don't know who you are dealing with, if identity, just establishing your identity is a problem, and you go to Dr. Kofi Mensah at Agri Development Bank, and you say to Dr. Kofi Mensah, I want to borrow money for my business. Now, they need to establish your identity, first of all. Uh, and if that is not clear, if there is any doubt about what your identity is, there may be even doubt about your age <laughs> and all of that you are not likely to get that loan if you don't have a track record that goes with your identity, you have a problem. And we had a situation in Ghana where for 60 years, we have a 30 million population, but we don't have unique identity numbers. And this is why we introduced um, and, and, and sort of went ahead to implement because in 2008, the National ID Card Project was introduced in 2008. But when we came into office in 2017, we thought that was the key uh, pillar for digitization of this economy. 